Scooby, thank you so much for giving Scooby. Me. Scooby, my bad. Got you. Scooby. Uh, well, first of all, uh, thank you so much for giving me the interview. How was the sparring session with Evans and Osaka? It was great. Uh, I believe it was the best. So I'm getting ready for my fight. I'm prepared June 29th at Sony Hall Theater. Yo, Edwin's is nice, he's cool. Good preparation for my camp, so yeah. Man, you look big, man. How is it that you make 140, brother? You, you look like exactly what you were, a football player. Man. Life, life. I keep working hard, as you can see. This isn't just the physique, it's just hard work and dedication, so. Uh, so, when it, uh, your fight's here in New York? Here in New York. Okay. Yes, sir. How exciting is that? You, I know you're not from New York. Yeah, yeah. You're training and living here. Hey, where I live my hat is where I'm home at. You know what I'm saying? So I'm here in New York. It's my home now. So and let's show it. Let's bring back New York boxing, like I said. Can you talk to me? I saw your interview with Aesop Boxing Talk. And you're very uh, deep into your Muslim religion. Can you talk to me how, how you got involved with, with Islam as well as how does that work for you in, in, in boxing and in life? Alhamdulillah. I use it as a, as a mental aspect. You know, I, I think I know that Allah is everything for me. So me going into the Muslim community, they accepted me open arms when I was at my worst. So being there and, and accepting and they accepted me was just the best thing that changed my whole life. Is it, uh, are you part of the nation of Islam or are you traditionally Muslim? I'm traditionally Muslim. Any, any opinion on the nation of Islam and how, how they go about things? Uh, I don't really know much. Um, I'll do my research on it and uh, get back to you on that. All right. For sure. Alhamdulillah. All right, so uh, how, how soon do you see yourself fighting for a world title? Uh, you're getting great work from great fighters. Yeah, yeah. And what you've shown on TV so far has been spectacular. Alhamdulillah. Uh, how, how soon do you see yourself fighting for a world title? One step at a time. I don't, I don't think too far in the future. I think about what's happening in the next 30 seconds. Okay. And that's the best thing in the world, you know what I mean? So there's a lot of things that could happen in... in like in like an hour or so, so you know what I mean. I take care of 30 seconds. But in the future, they say, "Yo, let it happen." All right. Where do you get that mentality from? Just going through the struggle, being in, being in the struggle, being in the gym, being in life. Life is a big struggle, but if you make it what it is, it can be a beautiful life, and that's what I did to me myself. All right. Well, thank you so much for your so. time.